what's the deal with the gang violence in Sweden? I read that the Swedish government has asked the military and police police chiefs to quench the rise in gang violence. The government blames irresponsible immigration policy in past administrations for the situation they're facing today. Is there truth to these allegations or is there more to this story? They also said there was a migrant crisis in 2015 that triggered a change in the immigration policy. What happened in 2015? Answer, first I must add. The military is not right now gonna be at our streets. The Swedish law doesn't allow this. They are supposed to aid and replace other areas in which the police are at. So more cops can be working to stop the gang violence. It is said that the government will look into the laws and make it possible for the military to aid the police more. But ATM it's not possible. To the violence. Immigration has been flooding to Sweden as all of Europe. And now second generation immigrants are very much represented in this. Actually statistics from Bra, a part of the government only looking into crimes when it comes to numbers, statistics, shows exactly this. Why it comes to this? Hard to tell. Our politics have different views and answers to the problem. It all comes down to, we took in too many without helping them adjust to the society and even make sure they do. We did not have a system in place for immigration, and still doesn't. It's sad and dark because it harms our country just as much as the immigrants. I'm sure many of them wants to adjust but it cannot be easy when you come from war, poverty and death. I don't say this to protect the gangs. Everyone have a choice of what you do with your life. 